Structural engineering is one of the very key area. Skeleton. Creation of the skeleton, you may need to make sure that if somebody is designing it, another person is checking it. Another person is doing the value engineering. 50% of your cost of the project is lying with the structural elements of the building. If they are not structured properly, if they are not designed properly, if they are not valued properly, your 50% budget is under ventilator. If you are having this kind of problem, this video is for you guys. Hello everybody, this is Sandeep here. Value engineering and proof checking. What is this? Value engineering is whatever the money that you are spending, is it really worth of spending that much amount of money or can we do certain trimming? Second thing is proof checking. If certain things, you know, somebody said that, you know, I'll give you 15 rupees per square foot structural engineering rate. Somebody says, no, 15 rupees, oh God, I got a competition now, I'll give 12 rupees. He will say, I'll give 10 rupees. Some people, they reduce it to four or five rupees. I don't know, actually, you know, it's very difficult to work on such kind of lesser rate. But what happens is, due to that, they will not get some time to do so many different types of iterations. For example, the iterations means, you know, analysis, static, linear, non-linear, dynamic analysis, vibration analysis, those so many different types of analysis, structural engineer, you need to do it. Unless and until you do it, you know, that, that kind of response or the structure, uh, you will not come to know the behavior of the structure to a certain extent, right? What is the proof checking? Proof checking means if somebody is doing the structural designing, some another guy is going to check it. Okay, this way you are going to divide the risk by two. At the same time, uh, value engineering is also, I've seen so many projects actually, believe me, okay, top, top consultants in India, they are doing blunderous mistakes, blunderous mistakes, okay. Some places in Mumbai, I don't want to take the name of the consultant or, uh, or the builder, the entire shear wall is there, the outside box shear wall is there, but it is not considered as a part of the analysis. It is not there in, as a part of the benefit. You know, it's it's very strange, basically, you know, such kind of things are happening. Another thing which I have identified is actually in the in the drawings, there is a slab thickness of around uh, uh, 150, 175 and all. But in the model, there is a 200, 250. In certain places, you know, there are so many related, you know, changes related to the loading. Huge amount of loading is given, which is not necessary only, right? And everything is under-designed. Now, since it is under-designed, actually, who, whom we need to blame is the contractor. <laughs> or that too, sometimes is the labor contractor. What the hell we are there into? And builder is not thinking, you know, the consultant is wrong. He's thinking he's a godfather, right? So, what is really happening, guys, right? So, it is very important, rather than completely believing on some, somebody, you have to genuinely do the proof checking. That is it really worth of doing? Let's say, for example, the carom board. Can you imagine the carom board? Carom board is the place where, where, for example, you know, this is an isolated footing and you are standing on the carom board at the center. Then it is a, it's not a problem. But if you, you are a column and a carom board is the, is the footing, if you are standing at the center, there is no problem. But if you are standing at the corner, what will happen? The carom board will start tilting from the other side. It will start lifting from the other side. And at the place where you are sitting, you will see that, you know, uh, the excessive amount of settlement is happening. Almost more than 70-80% of the buildings in Bangalore city are designed this way and get it constructed. Before doing puja, I means before inaugurating that vastu, you know, half of the life is gone, simply, right? Anybody don't want to construct the house, basically, just for one generation. Actually, my grandfather has constructed the house back in, in Maharashtra. You know, since the last three generations, it's, it's still there. So why don't you want to do this, actually? I mean, this doesn't take a huge amount of money. It, it generally takes some kind of, you know, intelligence and a challenge. All right. So, see, generally, if you see the consultation business, actually, it is just 2-3%, maximum 4%. Okay, but your 95%, 96% is under jeopardized situation. Don't do the cost cutting in 4%, for God's sake. Right? Otherwise, your 96% is there on the ventilator. Why you don't to do that? So it is very important. Do the cross-checking, proof-checking and all properly. If you are really want to last long the structures. Okay, structures is like, if you see, you see the Minakshi temple, Tirupati temple, you don't know what who all our engineers and architects worked upon it. We were having that kind of legacy. This is a Bharat. This is my country, actually. We were having that kind of legacy with us. Let's construct such kind of things, you know, like... Next five generations, people will see that who has constructed it. Instead of, you know, how many square foot that is your rate, what is your rate, what is your rate, what the hell we are doing, right? If you do not have a money, you just construct the skeleton, which is, you know, it, it cannot undo the skeleton. Once the foundation is done, oh my God, I have to add certain more bars. Can you add it now? No. You can change the tiles, you can change the colors, 
you can change many things you can remove the walls you can reconstruct the walls partition walls so what i'm trying to say is you invest certain things which is there going to be permanent more profoundly and then you start cost cutting in certain areas which you know is not that permanent right so this is why actually you should be working okay i'm sure that if you are really want to construct the house you will take care of this particular point if you really want any kind of help please contact us thank you so much bye bye